This video is just a quick overview of using a web browser. So the web browser is the tool you use to access your web content. So typically in a web browser up the top here you'll have an address bar. This is where you type in the actual address of the website if you know it. And generally you will start with http colon slash slash www for World Wide Web and then the remaining of the address. This is to access the content. Now within down here you would generally have uh, some tabs available. So I can have multiple windows open. So at the moment I have Google the search engine open. But say for example if I open up a new tab here and I put in Irish Times. This will open up the Irish Times website. So now I've got the Irish Times website open. But I also have Google open so I can swap back and forth between them. It's a very handy way of having multiple tabs with information open. Now if I want to close down the tab, I just click the X there and that removes the tab. So I'm left with Google. Now within here you'll have various menu options. Some of them for and I'll go through some of the important ones. For example here, you can print. So you can print the contents of the screen, which is quite useful. Here the edit menu, you can do things like selecting all the content on the screen, copying it pasting it onto another document so then you can print it out or view it after that. Here's various options for viewing, for example, zooming in on particular information to make it larger or viewing it in to make it smaller, reducing the size. So that's just one of the options and you can do it for text size and styles and change things from there. The favorites is a way of organizing your content so if I come across the Irish Times and I really like it, I might add it to my favourites. So if I go to the Irish Times here, I open up the Irish Times again. And I go, this is a site that I regularly visit. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to add the Irish Times to the favourites. And then I can select the folder where I add it. No particular folder of interest. I'm going to create a new folder and I'll go reading material. So I click on create there and click on add. Now anytime I want to add, I find the site, I go to favorite, I go to reading material here and I see Irish Times and then brings me straight to the Irish Times. That's your favorites. Generally there's some additional tools which is a more advanced functionality within your browser and you'll have some help as well. When you type in your information to website, you generally type it in here. Unless you're using something like Google. And uh, within Google, what you can do is you can type the information into the search here. So if I was looking for Fulcher Island, I'd type it in here. So it just gives you a quick overview of using a web browser.